Hey guys, so on this video I'm going to present to you my um, playlist the script which is the Ubuntu Hyperlag. Okay, so the Ubuntu Hyperlag, for those of you who, who have been following me or have been using my script, you probably know that the Ubuntu Hyperlag was on the Debian Hyperlag rep repo before still here still here however since now that the hyperland is made it to the ubuntu universe repo i was trying to you know like port it back to 24.04 but it's um harder than i thought so the the uh, the way i see it I, I mean excuse me if i'm wrong the way I see it, the packages made from the newer one, you cannot really use to the older version of the Ubuntu unless you add the repository. But, of course, uh, the newer packages on that repository will be overriding your packages. So, that's kind of like a lot of things to work. Of course, I can like, um, there is a way that to set a package to install only on the that particular repository if you add to your older or present ubuntu versions but it's a little bit complicated and then it's just creating much much work so then when i was a few days ago or yesterday when i was updating the system or updating the ubuntu hyperland because now before there see on the hyperland wiki about the Ubuntu, somebody made a uh, edit onto this to wiki and they just said that to add to universe repo. But it was not clear and by the way I have I have already pushed a correction in here. I think this is the one yeah. I have pushed the correction thirteen hours ago. Ho hopefully they will approve. And I added in here that the Ubuntu made it to the oracular universe repo so the reason why is if you search the if you do if you search the hyperland in ubuntu packages repo ah uh, there so when you search the hyperland it's showing here the oracular uh, branch or version now if you search the oracular here it's 2410 which will be October this month the oracular so this is still on beta version so I went ahead to refactor or recreate the, the restructure the Ubuntu hyperline script and that's the time that I decided to create a separate repo now for this the Ubuntu if you go to this Ubuntu hyperland uh, Ubuntu Hyperland repo there is no installation on the main branch that is because each branches are corresponding to Ubuntu versions now this Ubuntu 2404 this is just exactly same as here the step by step for the Ubuntu 2404 I just copy it and move it over here and then also going to the branch for this 2410 which is the oracular I have updated see 50 minutes ago and I believe it's already on the release candidate so feel free to test it now I will show you later on but here if you go to the main repo you will see here the how to use and branches on this repo and how to install is to clone this repo including the branch so please even though let's say you are on this branch you cannot just copy it here and then uh, git clone run the git clone no that's, that's not the case because you need to add also the branch which is here dash b 24.0.10 for example the branch 
So you will not get confused because branch will be according to the version, like I said, the released version of Ubuntu. And then, Dep1. Dep1 is only if you want to have the latest commits only on each files. So you don't have to download the whole commits. And then, of course, the this uh, repo. And then, downloaded it to your home folder. Okay? So that's the step by step. And then it will be same, you know, ch mode and then run the install sheets. This will be again same. I'm going to demo it to you now. Oh. This is on a VM. Let's open this first. Because this one is already the one which I have already installed the Hyperland. But I'm going to show it to you. And it's a little bit slow. Uh -huh. So still, let me just log in. And then it has that. <laughs> uh, what happened there? Too much. Okay, I I um, I have muted the desktop audio. It's good. Okay. So the first thing is, of course, run an update and then install git, the package git. You need the package git. So, of course, to do that is sudo apt update and, and sudo apt upgrade. Now, I'm not going to do that now, but it's advisable for you to run this before you run the script. Always. If you, if you need to install, it's always. So... Let's install first git, so do apt install git. And then you can see here also the sub packages. I'm not going to add the suggested packages. I'm just going to install the git because that's only what I need. We just make a full screen. So now you have the git installed. Now let's clone the Ubuntu Hyperland repo. Can I zoom in? No. Oh. Okay. So git clone p the branch, which is now this is the 24.10. And then tap one https kit dot com Ubuntu oh, capital H and then download it to your home folder. Then we see the it into the want to hyperland now ch mode plus x install that sh and then run the install that sh and by the way let me just minimize this all this instruction is in here okay And then, of course, as you see in here, they run a full system update. And then you'll be required to answer some questions during the installation. So once you have this, once the installer is already running, don't leave it. And if you are installing on a VM, just one thing about on the VM, um, VMware and, and VirtualBox, they have a very, very poor support of 3D acceleration so you might not be able to run and for me I'm using the uh, KMU with KBM so proceed yes and then of course this is NVIDIA GPU if you're using a VM even though you have a a NVIDIA unless you pass through of course you would say yes but now I said no then I wanted a GTK teams 
if I want Bluetooth, uh, Tuner file manager, this one. If you are already using the GDM or if you already have a GNOME, please do not install this because you will have you will run into some issues. So I would suggest not to install if you already have a GDM. I will show you later on, later on that I have GDM. Then this XCG desktop portal hyperland, this is for proper screen sharing, like for example the OBS. Yes. And then uh, ZHS Z shell and oh my ZHS and then of course this Pokemon color, color script will be you will be asked later on if you want it or not and for those of you who wanted to know about the Pokemon color script this is the one here um, by the way this drop down terminal Piperland I didn't set to install in Ubuntu and Debian that's because it's broken i couldn't make it really work so i n i did not install any set or i did not set to install piperland on it so yes yes and then nw look nw look is again oh. nw look this is the gtk settings so this is it's a nice it's a nice uh, app. This one have to manual. You have to manually build. So I'm just gonna say yes here for now, and then ROG laptops. Of course, if you have the ASUS ROG laptops, please say yes. And if you don't have, then say no. Since it's the VM, I will say no. And then of course the pre-configured that file. So once you do that, then let the let the install script run by itself and then um, and then answer as required sometimes it may ask to ask your password it depends uh, but my experience um, I it asks only one time but that's it okay so there's a process and now I'm gonna move over to another um, VM which is already Hyperland installed so I'm going to stop this now. And then this is already a pre-installed. Let me just see if I have, yeah, I had the 3D acceleration enabled. So So now this is the GDM, okay? I did not set to install the, I, I did not install the SDM. Once you click that one, then here, see here, Hyperline Ubuntu. Uh, hi Hyperline is there, or Ubuntu is there. So now, going in that one, and voila. So this work, it's a little bit slow here because this is a, again a VM, but on a hardware, of course, it's fast but everything is working fine and then of course uh, any hints if you go to the redmi okay that's enough for now so i'm just gonna switch this off so I can concentrate on the here. And by the way, I'm using a Harper, Hyperland here, but uh, I'm using a Gen 2 because this is my main. Just in case you know, uh, I mean, you wonder. I'm using the dots also that I'm sharing. So anyway, the Redmi on the main repo is not um, extensive as it is um, I will just switch it off and then if you go to the different branch here there is the redmi and I have update as much as I can in here I also explain as much as I can in here okay so that's just about it uh, Mm, wait just one thing here there's no pre-configured dots 
that that files can be checked which is a separate repo it will be pulled so in here this is my hyperland that's which i used for all the distros that i'm sharing plus there's also a wiki in here you will see the um, frequently asked questions some tips also here other distros release notes keybinds for example in case so i would really really suggest you please spend some time to go through this one because there's a lot who are asking questions on my discord and they have been been through here they found out that it's always here okay of course if you have any issues on the script feel free again this 24.10 is still on beta stage you are welcome to use it if you're using a 24.04 still using 24.04 the script is here and then of course if you need to download make sure to add the 20 branch 24.10 i believe i need to ah no no see this is uh, wrong i will edit this one i will edit this because like i said i copied it from my debian hyperland but i will edit this 24.04 okay that's just about it and again by the way i apologize i've been busy for the past few months so i haven't posted that much video but i do appreciate for those who are on my discord here and then uh, shout out of course to d dubs or don williams i think he was the second yeah here donald williams shout out to you my friend thank you very much for all your support for all your help and then um that's just about it i thank you also for the people who have con contributed to the project who are submitting an issue submitting a pull request merge merging it and so on so please you're welcome to to again uh, contribute to the project okay guys uh, so this is the video um not gonna edit much video so it's gonna be i think maybe not too long thank you very much and you have a good day bye